Now that she's arrived in the kind of magical world she's always dreamed of, Arus couldn't be happier. Even so, it's not exactly the way she imagined it. Arus met two apprentice witches who are about her age, Sheila and Eva. But as punishment for letting the fairies escape, the highest ranking authority in the witch realm, the Grand Master, cast the curse of eternal youth on both of them. world are you? Mm. Ta-da! <laughs> I'm the magician of happiness, the great Arus. <laughs> Arus? That's right. So do you get it now? This is how magic is meant to be used. Magic? That was just sleight of hand. Yeah, just a trick. Oops, guess I'm busted. No. Pardon her. She's just a stupid moron. See? She hit her head. We apologize. Lift her up. Uh. Okay. We'll do our best to find the fairies. Excuse us. <laughs> so that young girl is a rebel, then. She did seem pretty dumb, didn't she? <laughs> we have to cut the rebels off at the root before they have a chance to grow. Until we find evidence of a rebel organization, I want you to keep an eye on that girl. Yes, ma'am! What were you trying to prove? If Sheila hadn't stepped up and covered for you back there, they would have figured out that you're a human. And then you'd be in a whole lot more trouble than you already are. Excuse me. Why would being a human being be bad news here? It's just that humans are kind of like, um... Don't bother. It's not important. Besides, if they found out we knew she was a human, we'd be in hot water, too. I won't let her drag us down any more than she already has. Period. This wasn't to help her. Whoa. Ooh. Hey, I'm kind of hungry. There's no future for us unless we catch those fairies. We have to find them. Uh, Eva? We don't have a chance. Uh. We tried so hard and we couldn't do it, remember? That whole time we couldn't catch a single fairy. And now we'll never become full-fledged witches. We'll never get married. We're doomed, stuck in childhood forever. <laughs> That's the problem with you, Eva. <laughs> with magic or anything else in life, as soon as you hit a bump in the road, you give up. That's why you never get anywhere. Hey, who else is starving, huh? Let's find some delicious food. Extra How about Baba it, Eva? Yaga. Baba Yaga. Hold on. How come we were the only ones? Huh? They still think you're an apprentice witch, just like we are. So why weren't you cursed? Come on, guys. I'm so hungry. Let's get some grub. I mean, what kind of food do you have here anyway? Come to think of it, I know nothing about this world. Well, the pancakes here are really yummy. Pancakes? Oh, man. Pancakes cooked up by witches. That does sound yummy. 
<laughs> hey, what's the difference between pancakes and I hotcakes? challenge you to a duel. Huh? We'll have a broom race. If you lose, then you stop following me. What the heck is she talking about now? You can't race against her. Sweetheart's just human. It's not fair. She can't possibly if win. If you believe with all your heart, anyone can use magic. She said so herself. Yeah, but... Come on, Sheila. Do I have to keep saying it? Witches aren't supposed to use their magic powers to pick fights with people. That childish way of thinking isn't gonna cut it around here. If you don't want to race against me, fine. I'll be happy to ditch you now. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Don't worry. I'll never get in your business again, Sheila. But you're not getting any of my tasty chestnuts either. So there. <laughs> Catch you later, guys. Have a nice life. No. Wait, sweetheart! Let her go. But she... It's best to have nothing to do with that girl. Atelia senses something about her, too. If we get involved, there'll be even more trouble for us. <laughs> um, Eva? Fine. Do what you want. <sighs> Terrific. Now I have nowhere to go. Man, my stomach is grumbling. <sighs> Wait up! Sheila said some pretty mean stuff, but I still like you, sweetheart. We've got a lot we need to figure out, but first, let, let's go get some food. Uh, how about some yummy pancakes? What's the matter, sweetheart? Can we help the poor thing? Hold on, I'll get Sheila. No, wait. Uh -huh. If you tell Sheila, she'll just hand it over to those old lady witches, won't she? Well... <sighs> then I guess we're gonna have to duke it out with magic. Huh? But I thought you said magic should only be used to make people happy. And it will, if I win, that is. Help the Mina Fairy and let it go? And you have to get Sweetheart enough pancakes to make her burst. <sighs> Fine, you're on. Wow, it looks like one of our magic textbooks. This'll be a piece of cake. No human can ever fail if they're trying to do the right thing, you know. And it looks like I'm the only human here. Let's race. We'll circle the lake once. That hill's the finish line. On your marks! <sighs> get set! <sighs> Go! <sighs> she looks like she doesn't even know how to ride a broom properly. She tried to look it up in that book of spells. Book of spells? What are you doing? Sheila took off already! But if I straddle this thing, it's gonna hurt! Hey, I got an idea! All right, here we go! Woo! What? Whoa, that's amazing! I'll go wait at the finish line, okay? Well, go on after her! Okay! In the end, a human's just a human. Oh, she. Said Eva, it wasn't your fault. It's all right. Move. Hey, let it go. Now that it's all better. Uh, okay. Thanks, Sheila. You lost. Now get out of here. Huh? I don't ever want to see your face again. But sorry, a deal's a deal. She Right, I get the point. So long, guys. But she's all alone, Sheila. She's just a human. <sighs> Did 
Did you just hear that unimaginable word? Uh, she did say humane, right? No, she said human. Human? And she has a book of spells? <laughs> Good. Now, I have added another task to your list of endeavors. You are to appropriate that girl's book of spells. No matter what you must do. From the heart. And if you believe it with all your heart, anyone can use magic. <gasps> hey, Yoko! The milk in the fridge is past his expiration date. No, <sighs> I was dreaming. <sighs> oh, anyway, this looks more like a dream than anything else. Huh, believe with all my heart. Maybe there's some kind of magic to send me home. Yeah, right, that would be way too easy. Huh? Huh? <laughs> who, who the heck are you? Well, I was gonna ask you that. Huh? huh? What do you know? You're the girl from the other day. Huh? Wait, you mean you've heard of me? Sure, the little girl who went wild on that broom and set us all free, right? For real? Am I famous or something? This is kind of embarrassing, but hey, if you really want to thank me, you could help me find some breakfast. I'm not that grateful. <laughs> uh. Aku fairies are a type of fairy that will grant a child one wish, but only one. They mainly inhabit sandy beaches and give off a unique scent. Stinky. <sighs> You're late. Sorry, I didn't sleep well last night. After breakfast, we'll capture fairies. I wonder where Sweetheart ended up spending the night, or if she got to eat. Is not growing up okay with you? Mm -mm. The only person you should be worrying about is yourself. But there's no way we're ever gonna find all the fairies that escaped. Did you obtain the Book of Spells? We're still working on it, but... But that special task force is something else. They've been delivering fairy after fairy all morning. You're so smart, Atalia. You handpicked the best and the brightest. I mean, they're the top. Yeah, yeah. Now let's not waste any time. All we need are the tails and nails and stuff like that. Who cares about the rest? Exactly. Besides, I think we deserve some entertainment. Uh, you better watch what you say to us! Yeah, that's right! If Italia hadn't put in a good word for you with Grandmaster, all of you would have been sent to the human realm. <laughs> you needn't worry. We destroyed nothing. There wouldn't be any point in killing them. Italia. I think you should fire these ruffians on the spot! Yeah, fire them! Do as you please, in the same manner you've always conducted your business. But remember, your top priority is to appropriate the Book of Spells from that girl. Yeah, we get it. And under no circumstances are you to harm that girl in any way. Save your breath. What a bunch of barbaric slime balls! No! Oh, what should I wish for? No. Come on, little lady, hurry up and make up your mind. Look, you just said you were hungry a little while ago. Why don't you just wish for something to eat? Will you give me a second? I'm still thinking. Uh, should I go for food? Enough chestnuts to fill up my belly? No, wait, I only get one wish. I've got to use it for something completely awesome. I know, giant chestnuts. Oh, is that all I can think of? Chestnuts? What are you hemming and hawing about? I don't have a lifetime! Mm -hmm. I guess.
guess I should want to go back to my own world. Your own world? Yeah, I'm a human, so I come from the human realm. I don't need all the details, as long as you're decided. Your wish is to go back to the human realm, right? No, oh, hang on. It's kind of a shame to leave when I just got here. <gasps> no, wait! <laughs> oh, now what is it? Listen. Hey, Sheila, are Aku fairies scary, strong, mean? Listen, all you have to do when you see that Aku fairy is make him grant you a wish. Why? Because he can break the curse of eternal youth. I'll worry about capturing the fairies. I think we've got one. Um, I don't know, but there's lots of them in there. It looks like they're throwing a party. Let's move closer. child is not one of us, and therefore not our concern. Uh, what? We've been sent here to recapture the fairies, and that's it. Go ahead and take out that fairy right along with the apprentice witch. Fairy here, too. Wait, that human Bratatelio is talking about. Isn't that her down there? I bet now you'll be happy to get me some food, won't ya? <sighs> wow, this is so great! It's really good with this on it! Huh? But, Eva, isn't this paint? What's paint? <sighs> Why did you rescue me? Well, shucks, I was just hungry. After all, I'd hardly eaten anything since I got here. Tell the truth. You were going to use your Aku fairy wish to break the curse of eternal youth they put on us, weren't you? <laughs> How'd you know? Sorry I couldn't. Why didn't you just use the wish for yourself? Listen <gasps> to you. You wanted the same thing. You were planning to have the fairy break the curse on Eva, right? But why didn't you tell him you wanted to go back to the human world? I told you a hundred times. What? I'll be fine. As long as I believe and have my book... Ah! Huh? What's the matter? My book of spells. I can't find it. No way. Uh, here it is. Beware that in exchange, the child whose wish is granted shall lose one thing dear to her. Uh. Uh. 